ingot anyone? Silver Steeler here. Yeah, a couple of odds and ends that I picked up at my local coin shop. And one of these is this, what looks like it'd be a one ounce bar, although I think it's heavier than that. It's an ingot from the Franklin Mint. I guess they made like a hundred of these things and different, you know, arts and stuff like that on the front of the coin. And this one would be, of course, Paul Revere headed towards Independence Hall. We searched and searched and searched. I could not find a picture of this particular bar. But they're selling the complete sets of these things for like four or five thousand bucks. Most of the ones I see were around forty, fifty bucks. It's sterling silver, so it's ninety two point five percent silver. We think that the silver content in this bar is one point zero four ounces, but we're not positive about that. So here's the front. And here's the reverse. And on this, in the back of it, it's the Bicentennial Council of the 13 Original States. It's the official commemorative ingot, number 27, issued July 2nd, 1976, Dover, Delaware. There's a tiny little F on the bottom. And I would definitely think that'd be for the Franklin Mint. Um... It's sterling there. And it's got these marks. I'm sure that describes something about it as well. They made these from 1973 to 1981. And then they stopped doing them. We've seen complete sets of these on eBay go for like four or $5,000. And this one's a little roughed up. Doesn't have the original box or anything that came with it. But really, this one was a little bit hard to research, wasn't it? Yeah, we never found this one. Never found this one. Doesn't mean that they're not out there. I'm sure they are. And if I were to give it a value, it'd probably be about you know, 40 to 50 bucks. Seems what they're selling them for on eBay. Yeah, mine's got a few marks on it and stuff. Like I said, I don't have the original box and all, so that was an odd one. And we have here, I never saw this one before, too. The Battle of Gettysburg. On the front, it's the Battalion Surprise at Oak Hill, July 1st, 1863. And then on the reverse, there is a lot of words on there. Of which it says, The Battle of Gettysburg. The world will little note nor long remember what we say here, while it can never forget what they did here. July 1st through 3rd, 1863, Abraham Lincoln, Gettysburg Address, Three Desperate Days. There you have it. I've never seen this round before. I think it's, uh, I like a busy coin. It's got a lot of writing on it. So, a couple of odds and ends. Two pieces of history. I love it when I go there and he's got little things like this that Heck, I don't even know they made them. It makes me do research into them, especially that one right there. That one's pretty cool. I love the horse riding off towards Independence Hall with Paul Revere on it. Yeah. We've seen a couple of those ignits that had him on there on a horse, running in some other direction, ringing the bell, doing all these other things. but Running up to a porch, it looked like. Yeah, and it was like, never saw this one, so... Weird. Anyone else got any information? Feel free to write it down there in the comments and help me out with this one. Anyway, I'm going to bring this video to a close. Remember to like, subscribe, and all those other good things. I'll see you on the next video.